Hello, I'm Seek97. Today I'm going to show you how to install your own skin into Minecraft 1.3.2. So, first you need to get your skin, whatever, and I downloaded mine from the Skindex, and it's a Crash Bandicoot one. And you just want to download it and then rename it CHAR or CHAR because that what that does it overrides the existing file name inside the Minecraft game files with your own skin. So we can get started putting this into your Minecraft. So this first step I'm going to show you is how to get this skin to work if you're playing Minecraft offline. So you know when you log on and the internet doesn't connect correctly and it says um, failed to connect to Minecraft uh, play offline. Um, the method I'm about to show you now will allow your skin to work in that situation. So what you need to do is go to start, run and type percent app data percent. Click OK and then go to Minecraft then bin and then open that minecraft jar with 7-zip or winrar I'll do it with 7-zip because that's free so anyone can get that so you just open that and then you find the folder called mob and as you can see there's a file here called char which you kind of open but that basically has the steve skin and then you want to go to your skin so the skin you rename char and drag that into that folder in 7-zip click yes and as see it's updated because this file size has changed so that's our skin installed into minecraft if you're playing offline now this next method i'm going to show you is how to install your skin into minecraft if you're running if you're playing online single player so with the integrated server or on a multiplayer server so what you need to do is go to the minecraft.net website and you want to click login and use your um, correct details I'll just remember that and then once that's logged in you want to go to profile and here it says skin or change skin and then here it says skin and then choose file on uh, Win Internet Explorer it should say browse and then you select it so same thing and you want to find that folder so go to where the um, skin is um, so there it is find your skin click upload and it should say your skin has been changed it will take a couple of seconds for it to update so that's our skin installed into minecraft for both offline and online playing so let's say you did those two methods I showed you and it didn't work your skin did um, change and it's still the steve to you and to people on the server or whatever um, there's two solutions to this one is it's probably you've got a crack server or something so you need to change that and buy minecraft but if you have bought in it's still not working and you're really annoyed then this next method should work and should fix this it's by finding your skin on something called the skin deck so microskins.com search for it find your skin and then open it it should come to this page and it should say here upload to minecraft so if you click that it will take you to the minecraft page but it'll take you to a different looking page which says you're about to change the final skin is that what you want and you click change and it says that your skin has been changed so that's uh, another way of changing your skin on minecraft we're going to see if the skin actually updated and i'm going to be using the survival island map for my last tutorial to show this so if i hit f5 you can see that my skin has changed and if you see in the inventory as well you can see that it's changed as well so that's how since successfully changed into minecraft 1.3.2